What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to upgrade your graphics driver with Intel on your laptop. So I've experienced a problem in the past where my HP laptop, whenever I would do updates that HP was telling me to do, it wasn't doing one of the updates and that was for the graphics driver. And I never realized until I wasn't able to watch videos on my laptop or even edit my own videos on my laptop because the graphics driver was never actually updating. Now I did have to go and download the Intel driver and support assistant, which I'm gonna be sharing with you today on how to do that. And with that, I was able to see that the graphics driver was never actually updating and there was a long pending updates available for the graphics driver. So I'm gonna share with you guys how to do that today in case you are experiencing the problems. It's not just for the graphics driver, it is for anything that Intel has on your laptop. You can actually go and use this to be able to do any of the updates that are available and I actually find it a lot smoother and it catches all of the updates that might have been missed in case there are others. Let's get right into this. Okay, so switched over to my laptop here. As you can see, if you just Google Intel driver and support assistance, the first tab should bring you to this screen here where you can actually go and download it. So to download it, you're gonna hit the blue download button. And it does tell you here that it's for Windows 7, Windows 8, 8.1, 10, and 11. And it tells you the size for the updates. That's what you need to do to be able to go and see what updates are available is to download this assistance, which is really easy to do. Once you have downloaded the Intel driver support assistant and have it on your laptop, you should be able to, once you open it, bring it to this page here. Now it actually does tell me in the yellow bar that there is a download available, but I'm gonna go and select devices and drivers and I'm gonna go and see everything that there is and I'm gonna click on the graphics driver. Right here you see the blue button that says update available and below that it actually says the date it was actually last updated and it gives you all of the other details there. So it says for me it wasn't updated until October 14th, 2020. That was the last time there was an update for this. So I'm gonna go ahead and click the update available button and once it does start updating, you will see it finish. There'll be other screens that pop up on your laptop, but you will be able to download and do the update this way if your laptop was never catching that update like it has been for me. So this has been pending for literally two years and the HP updates were never actually catching that this was never actually being updated. So I did have to go and do it this way and I thought to share it with you guys in case other people are experiencing the same problem where not necessarily just HP, but Toshiba or any other laptops uh, makers that you do have a laptop with, if you're doing the updates that are regular with them, sometimes not everything is being catched. So since I do have Intel in my laptop, I actually found out I had to go and download the support assistance. And that's where I found that the graphics driver was not actually updating. So hopefully this has helped you guys find what is not updating for you guys and manually going and selecting and updating them that way, as opposed to waiting for your laptop to tell you to update them and it not actually working for you. So I hope this has helped and I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.